told you, no matter what it was, that's the direction that you went. Yes, sir. Why? Give, give it, this is tremendous insight here. Why? Well, it tells me that's the that, that's the job. And so I don't want to bring it up, but I want to I would have so I could have thrown that out. Ernie, did you do what the people around you who managed you, who you felt had your best interest at hand? Did you tell them what to do, or did they tell you what to do? They told me what to do, and I did. It was on the board, not more than I was. I take a chance to do it. I did what you told me to do. Did you ever disagree with that and, and give them your input? Very, very seldom. I do, I can't remember. Why, why wouldn't you? Because they, they were training me, and they've been back in law and they had knowledge of it, so. If we do it, I go and do it. Michael, uh, you and Leon uh, had some great advisors. Did you guys listen to them all the time, or did you take control of your own career? Yeah, we listened to them uh, the majority of the time because uh, they had uh, knowledge of what they were doing, and we trusted them. Thank you. Yeah, you know, for me, I was obviously leading my own career, so I actually told my manager who I wanted to fight. Banner. Jim Thomas, tell you what to do or you tell Jim? No, no, it was no, no, it, it was uh, it was it was it was uh it was uh Lou Duba. Lou Duba tell okay. me, you know, so if he told me to fight somebody I'd fight him because Lou Duba. I, I didn't choose another fight. I I would I didn't want to do that because I was afraid I'd choose somebody to beat me and I'd be mad. <laughs> So, <laughs> I didn't choose to go by. <laughs> Buster? Well, unfortunately, I chose. So, I chose to fight this man. I wanted to fight the best. And, I, you know, it was just that uh, when I can't win with it. Jerry? Thank you. You know, unfortunately, I had two managers that didn't care about developing me as a fighter. They wanted to make the big fight with Holmes. So, I was fighting in my heyday once a year. I mean, come on. And that's what happened. I, you know, I got caught up in that, and, and what went on went on. But uh, listen, these guys will fight anybody, and I would too. You know, I, mean, I was speaking to uh, Andre Ward. He said, if they offered you a hundred million dollars to fight Joshua, would you do it? I said, yeah, I would do it. He said, so would I. That's what fighters do, right? All right, let's go down the line and, and, and let's talk about.